Okay, time's up. Bye, on. Good job. watching my video and today actually we're gonna be for the first time you're gonna experience going for CrossFit with me I'm not really a CrossFit person nor am I a gym person but I would like to get you guys on this journey of exercising with me and I chose CrossFit because everybody says it's really really hard but like I want to see and test if it's actually really hard or people just might do. Um, so this is going to be an episode of fitness and we're going to have five episodes, five weeks where we're going to do CrossFit and then we're going to measure my body weight, mass, muscle, whatever. And we're going to compare week by week to see how much of, you know, transformation has happened during the five weeks though. And then I hope that this will inspire you guys to start working out as well. So it's the first day of CrossFit. I have five more weeks of this. environment you don't really have the conventional um, gym machines like things that I've never seen before the only thing that seems pretty familiar are the weights other than that I've never used a box to jump in my life and I've never really used like skipping ropes and I've never really done like ropes you know just hanging on the wall and things like that like it I have no idea what I'm putting myself in and what kind of world I'm entering. It's pretty exciting actually. So why do you know about CrossFit? You guys basically have a more unconventional way of um, you know, getting fit. Okay. Um, <clears throat> you how you are you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine you use a lot of tools okay. and there's a lot of like different variations okay almost there oh. <laughs> well, the meaning of crossfit is number one is high intensity oh yeah oh yeah yeah uh, so really so really high intensity like like macam nak mati oh nice Sometimes can be short, sometimes sometime can be long. And then number two is functional movement. It functional. is whatever you did outside, you're going to do here with the correct form. With, with, uh, with the correct form technique. Oh. So essentially, you're going to do deadlift. You deadlift, how to do proper technique, and you can apply on the outside. Okay. And number three is constantly various. Every day is different. Oh, good. 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 Today different. More different, but every day you're going to do the same. Okay. Because we combine two elements. Number one is monosocial cardio, carry, rowing, skipping. Uh -huh. Number two is gymnastic, all in both body weight. Push up, squat, you can see uh, pull up, bring muscle up, rope climb. And number three is. Okay, number three is weightlifting. Weightlifting. Yeah. And snatch. So, all three, that's why it's every day is different. So, that's all about the Yay! Okay. Yes. Okay. 
So this is what you're going to do for today. But before that, we're going to do warm up. He started explaining everything that I had to do. Terus I rasa nak demam. Terus I rasa I regret coming here. I don't know what I'm doing. I think I just want to go back to yoga and swimming. <laughs> but it's too late because I paid. <laughs> There's no refund. <sighs> not fun, not fun yet. Anyway at all. Thought I missed it by waiting for the game response. For the last Oh my god, this is only round two. Two more of this. Good day, you woman. You should be less normal. So there's a lot of liquids in my tummy for the first day and then right after I had my breakfast I went straight up the liquid in my tummy going like hey remember me? <laughs> I haven't digested yet I'm still hanging into your tummy I can come up anytime but I was trying to ignore it you know be professional I was trying to be tough I didn't want to show him that I had no stamina oh, I had to be one of those clients that he was going to be proud of Nana Daniel, so strong, so much stamina, love her. You know, you just want to be a good student. And then... <laughs> Alright, so for my first lesson, um, apparently I didn't pace myself well. And just now, as you can see, I was dying. Because beforehand, before, before coming to the session, I went, to the, I went for breakfast and I had pumpkin soup, I had a whole glass of green tea, I had sandwich, and I went straight upstairs and started my high intensity workout which led to me puking in the bathroom just now but we're not gonna give up, we're gonna finish the round literally half an hour already and that's just two rounds I 
hated CrossFit and I just want to give up. Why did I even sign up? At this point, Tom really doesn't mind losing a client. He didn't give any discounts or more. Three, two, catch first and then squat. Catch the first, okay. Squat. So that is squat one. During a session, there will be a few repetitions if you have to do it again and again, right? I can't. There's just nothing left in me. This is my first session. I don't understand why every trainer I go to, even before, the first session, they always want to scare the crap out of you. They give you the longest, hardest sessions so you will remember and not want to come back. Curl into a ball of lazy. Counting the time. Easy, it can be hard. Touch. Take something. Take a bun. From there. How do I look? One back. Come on. Getting better now. Classic, classic. Abis kan, abis lah. No, last one. My first session done. Yeah, 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 yeah. I find, find, find. Ah, finally, I started my exercise fitness training for TGR. Ada lagi lima minggu. This is my first day. Nanti kita akan tengok from time to time how much I progress. Okay, guys. Nak masuk dalam situ sikit. Wow. This machine is judging me real time. <laughs> All right. So I weighed myself, and basically I'm 63.3 kg. And a lot of people are surprised, like. You don't look that big, or you don't look that heavy, but I'm actually big boned. I have big bones on my body and it's very heavy, so it's not all fat. My fat percentage is 27.7%. That's a lot of fats. Fat mass is adalah lemak lemak di badan tu, how much does it weigh? Lemak je semua. So my lemak itself is 17 kg, guys. Yeah, that's quite worrying tau. I got big bum. Um, and muscle mass is 43.1 kg. Not bad. So my metabolic age is 26. I am 26, so there you go. My BMI is 22, along with my ideal body weight. Oh, actually, my ideal body weight is supposed to be 63.6 kg. So I'm 0.3 kg below my ideal body weight. Cuma, dia tak boleh lah banyak lemak. Dia kena lah more muscle dan lemak. So I think the muscle and lemak uh, percentage can be done. Kurangkan lemak dan tingkatkanlah muscles. My degree of obesity is 0 0.01. Nothing to worry about in terms of obesity. There you go. So this is what we're going to compare from week to week so you guys have a good idea of how much I actually lose or gain in, in my workouts. And that will be also a good detail uh, for you guys to also check week by week so you know your development as well and at the same time I always always advise to get enough sleep when we work out because it's gonna be so tiring for the body anyway guys thank you so much for joining me on my first CrossFit workout it was fun <laughs> yeah and I almost died yeah and you know what I believe I'll be better week by week so if you guys want to check out my progress don't forget to check Diana Daniel TV see you guys next week
Alright, so kita akan makan some protein based food. Okay, you know after exercise you just feel really happy and all the endorphins are coming out of your body. You just ah! <laughs> so that's how I'm feeling. I'm just smiling at everyone and like feeling really good. Hujan <laughs> platu. So good. So, uh, so siapa yang tak tahu, bukanlah kita training training pun nak pun nak tadi makan macam ni sia sia je. But protein is very good for building muscles, and you need this in order for you untuk basically dapat more muscles lah in your body. Wow. Alright guys, takkan nak tengok yang makan je. I'll see you guys. Later!